All right, what's going on everyone? It's Paul here and another week means another video. We just won't talk about what happened last week. That That's water under the bridge, right? But for real, one of the big things that was going on the last week is I was moving, a bunch of things happened. I didn't have internet access on the weekend or like for like the first four days I was here. So it was really tough to get a video going. Anyways, sorry about that. We're gonna make it more consistent going forward, but at least we're here this week, right here, right now. So with that being said, I mean, two weeks worth of updates. That's kind of a big deal, right? I feel like since the last time I've seen you guys, uh, I haven't really been in too many streams. Uh, with that being said, Caleb is kind of taking over the streams for now until I kind of get settled. And send me to live someplace awful like Ohio. Shots fired in the chat for Ohio? Ohio Good so God, lady. No. Well, I, was in, I was in one stream, but uh, in the new place. I don't know if you guys have ever like tried streaming and then you move to a new place and you're trying to stream and it's like, it's just not comfortable yet it takes a little bit of like time i guess to like readjust to like what you're getting into so hopefully that kind of irons out over the next like few weeks or whatever but even now with our work schedules we're, we're kind of like on opposite schedules so we'll even see if we get a chance this week to stream i know caleb can it's gonna be tough for me maybe just because i can't stream on my own i my computer is is trash that's the next big purchase one day, but with a trash computer you can't really run games and stream at the same time So it's kind of a it's not an ideal setup as far as everything else in my life I mean like the move was just like so much work But me and Kia were like on top of everything like we got everything sorted out like like right away There was no like there was no time off except like we were Massively sick for like a good three or four days last week, which really kind of delayed some things But looking back on it, we were effective enough to like get everything moved in like couches table desk Bed everything was good to go like within a week. So that's I feel like that's a big accomplishment So it's just a matter of adjusting to life here and like putting it all together So we have like the videos coming through and the streams coming through I want to show you guys the video of the place later. It's still like, like everything's here, but we're still like putting our little touches on it. So things have even changed. Like you might be able to see plants in the background. There aren't plants in the video because we're still like decorating it, I guess. Decorating the place bit by bit by bit. Get some paintings hung up and whatnot. But yeah, um, even like getting back into the fitness groove has been challenging. Finding a new gym, finding a new routine, navigating through the sickness to find that routine has been like, oh, it's it's been a headache but uh, I really have to get on it because I have football playoffs coming up and in a matter of a few weeks, I really gotta be on my game because since the injury, I feel like I've lost so much confidence in my like catching ability. But um, regardless if I lost the catching ability, you gotta get the legs going and gotta just keep practicing and, and getting back the reps so that I can kind of, you know, be comfortable, be confident again when it comes to catching. I don't know if you guys have ever played sports and gotten an injury, but it's it's a mental thing just as much as it is physical. So that's kind of like where I'm at with that right now. So I'll hopefully have some updates for you with the with the playoffs coming up soon. So with that being said, I want to keep this short, uh, just a short update because I want to show the video of the place and I want to get to Caleb's uh, portions too. But hopefully going forward, we'll, we'll extend it a little bit, go into a little more detail. So just uh, stay tuned for that going forward. And uh, you know, guys, I'm, I, I really do miss the streaming portion of it and I can't wait to get back to it. So yeah, like hopefully sooner rather than later, I can get comfortable with it and, and, and get back into like three streams a week. So that's just so you can see the the outsider's perspective to what I'm doing um, and, and why I haven't been around as much lately. But moves done, sickness is done, everything's coming back into balance again. So I'm hoping to catch you guys ASAP. So thanks a lot for sticking around, guys. And here's Caleb. Hey, what's going on, everyone? Welcome to my section of the video vlog. These past two weeks have been hectic for me and Paul. With him moving out and a bunch of stuff happening for me at work, it's been really, really tough for us to get the content out that we've been wanting to, as well as streaming as much as we said we would. But now that the dust is settled, we're hopefully going to be able to get everything cleared up, our schedules in sync so we can give you those three streams a week that we've been saying we want to get, as well as the weekly vlog video put out on YouTube and maybe some bonus videos in there too, you know? We'll see what we can do. So Paul's move went great. I'm just going to let you guys know I did help him out a bit. A little bit as much as I could help to move his new couch in it looks great so for me the past couple of weeks have been hectic I had uh, somebody at work leave 
and uh, everyone kind of had to pick up the pieces and, and fill shifts where they could here and there. So it's been very hectic and, and um, hard for me to get some of the streaming done that I've been wanting to, as well as the content. The gym has been good, but because of the work situation, it made uh, this last week pretty difficult. Now there's definitely times where I could have gone to the gym, but my sleep schedule has been like all out of whack, all over the place. I'm not getting to bed when I should. I'm having a difficult, uh, having a difficult time waking up uh, when I want to, which is I want to get those 6 a.m. starts going. I keep talking about them all the time on stream. You guys are probably so annoyed of me talking about trying to get these 6 a.m. starts going, but it's something I really want to focus on for getting up and getting some content done for either YouTube or if I want to get Twitch plugins done or going to the gym, whatever it is, I just want to get that locked in. That being said and done, getting 6 a.m. starts is going to be hard as a streamer. Uh, me and Paul made the decision a while ago to do night streams because we see the biggest influx of people coming into the channel, our community, when you guys can come in and see us. It's kind of we set that sweet spot between, for us anyways, in the Eastern uh, Standard Time Zone, between 5 to 11 p.m., somewhere in that area. With the 6 a.m. starts though, it's not going to be possible to go to 11. We want to be getting eight hours sleep. So I feel like the streaming might suffer when we when we go to get these going on. But it's something for mine and Paul's mental health that we're, or Paul and I are for our mental health that we, um, we really want to get going on. So we'll see how it all unfolds the next couple of weeks or even the next week. I mean, I'm not even on those starts yet, so we'll see. Fingers crossed for all that, you know. I really want to get it going on. I know I'm just rambling about it now. It's it's just tough though, getting that going when you're streaming late at night because you're wired after. You get, you get done streaming and you're pumped. You know, you had a good session, played some awesome games. You just want to rewatch the content. Uh, analyze yourself, check out the follows, all the comments, and that alone takes a couple of hours to just wind down from. So it's hard just jumping right into bed and going to sleep right after. So the realistic side of that is you have to end a little bit earlier so you have more time to unwind. And it's something I know we can do, but it's gonna take a lot, of, a lot of effort and time to force ourselves into that rhythm. We're gonna get there. Hopefully uh, the next vlog, I'll be telling you how I'm waking up at 6 a.m. and getting all the stuff that I wanna get accomplished done. So going forward, that's my goal is 6 a.m. starts, getting the gym consistently now. I have been good, this past week has been shoddy, but getting the consistency back on track, getting more be real. We need to do a lot more um, recording outside of these vlogs and Paul touched on it a little bit in the last video how it's so difficult to do. It is so hard to force yourself to pull out that camera, take a quick video of what you're doing and just keep that in the back of your mind whenever you're going out throughout your day. For me, I'm not one of those uh, people that like doing that so I have to force myself to do it. It's a big hurdle that I need to overcome. I got to do it for you guys because we promised that's what we're going to do for this vlog. We're going to show you guys some entertainment, not us just sitting down and, and go rambling on for like five, 10 minutes, but some actual content video of what's going on behind the scenes. So I'm going to make it my conscious decision and choice to force myself to pull that phone out and record things throughout my day. It's probably going to be the biggest struggle for me. It's got to be done though. It's got to be done. So those are my goals for this week, as well as I've been having, um, I've been having a tough time uh, with being mentally positive and focused about the stream and the Twitch content. I've been kind of all over the place about it, mixed feelings. Uh, you guys are amazing. It's nothing to do with the community. It's growing and I love it. But it's more of my, my personal side when I say uh, what I want for my future and how I want to get there. And this is a process. Going through this is going to take some time. It's not going to happen overnight. So getting my personal life with work and everything aligned with that and being happy, I'm finding very, very difficult. I don't really want to touch on it too much now. Maybe I'll go into a little bit of a rant on it next time we're on stream because there's a lot that I really want to talk about and I can't condense it down into just like a, a 10 minute video. And I don't want to ramble on about it because it's not really that interesting. And it's not really that interesting me just rambling on about it. So in the next stream, I might touch about that a little bit and talk about it. So, hey, remind me in the next stream to talk about it, all right? So that's pretty much that for this video. I hope you guys are enjoying the content so far. Please, 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 if you are, comment, tell us what you think. Tell us what you want us to see. 
Give us a like, give us a follow, turn, turn, turn those notifications on. <laughs> turn those notifications on guys, because it all counts. The views all count up and helping us grow this community and building better video content for you guys. Remember, Twitch is where you can find us for streaming video games, as well as you can follow us on Instagram and Twitter. And until next time, this is a phrase that I'm trying to coin. Love yourself, be kind to others, and make the world a better place. There it is. We'll see you guys in the next one. Should I have winked? Probably not. It's a little weird. Oh, well. I'm done. Hey guys, we're just here at Paul's new place, so uh, let's go in and uh, see what it looks like. Oh, hey. How's it going? Come on in. This is Cribs. <laughs> so if you don't know yet, we just moved, me and Kia. There's Kia over there. Just wanna get a quick look at her. So we just moved out from the basement. This is officially the third floor lounge now. Uh, still a work in progress, but we got the, did I say couch? We got the bed, <laughs> the bed. But we just got a little TV in here for now. Uh, nothing too special. We're gonna get the 75 inch ordered up in five years. Uh, we just have a coffee table in here until we get a desk. But yeah, two closets, hers and his, the two dressers, hers and his. So we got a little bit of yin, yin and yang going on in here. All right, let's go to the bathroom first. We got boxes, because we like to keep boxes as decor. That's John. John lives on the couch. No, I'm kidding, John <laughs> lives downstairs. So you all know John, he's, he's our, our manager. Tim, officially in the flesh, come to check out the couch. Uh, so here we have the bathroom, nothing special. This is where ones and twos happen, and sometimes bathing, <laughs> occasionally. And if you see over here, we have this beautiful table donated to us from Kia's aunt and uncle. They are the best. Thanks to them, we were able to make this happen. And obviously, you have a kitchen, but standard kitchen, but I'm gonna show you the main room now. Wow! Look at this couch, also donated by Kia, Kia's aunt and uncle. This thing is amazing. We got the, the TV with the guitar, a little bit ambiance. Don't really play guitar that well, so don't ask. <laughs> then some yoga, because I like to stretch it out, you know? Their hard day's work of streaming and Show YouTube. Well. That's a separate video. Ooh, content. <laughs> <laughs> That's a content indeed. And this is the setup. And then, of course, we got the RGB lights. Hey, Google, turn off Smart Bulb. Sure, turning off Smart Bulb 2. It looks like Action. Smart Bulb 1 isn't available right now. Yeah, we'll have to work on that. It's still a work in progress. <laughs> but yeah, so now that you've seen the new place, know where I'm streaming from. So hopefully you can kind of get an idea of what's going on with the basement lounge. So hopefully you'll see this on a video in the near future. But thanks to Caleb for helping me move the couch. This is a lot of work today. That's why we're a little gassed. Why don't you show yourself, Caleb? I can show you. Maybe like one of your French girls. Oh God, you sullied that couch. <laughs> I have to throw this away now. But anyways guys, that's essentially it. John, Caleb, Paul, we'll see you guys around. Okay. All right, you want to race? Woo! Oh good God, oh God! <laughs> oh, this is terrifying. Oh my God. Oh God, this is where we die. <laughs> there he goes! Caleb! There he goes! Bye, Bob! <laughs> Caleb! Oh my god! Bob! <laughs> What's happening? Oh my god.